Tanya Roberts, an actress of great talent and breathtaking beauty, left an everlasting mark by portraying the brave and enchanting Carrie in the iconic film The Beast Master, released in 1982. This particular role became a turning point in Tanya Roberts' career, establishing her as a rising star and opening countless opportunities for future projects. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and give it a like to support us. In the 1940s, the talented and captivating Janet Blair charmed the entertainment industry with her brilliant talent and enchanting beauty. Born on April 23, 1921 in the United States, Janet emerged as one of the most prominent stars of the era, garnering the admiration of fans and critics alike for her charisma and exceptional artistic abilities. In the year 1973, the talented and stunning Sally Kellerman shone brightly in the film industry. Her portrayal of Hot Lips Houlihan earned her a nomination for the prestigious Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress, marking a significant milestone in her career. In the 1960s, the stunning Raquel Welch emerged as a cinema icon, establishing herself as one of the most beautiful and talented women of that era. Raquel Welch began her career as a model, showcasing her impressive beauty in magazines and commercials. During the 1970s, The Benny Hill Show achieved a status as a television phenomenon, captivating the audience with its peculiar and unmistakable humor. Created and starred by the British comedian Benny Hill, the show secured a prominent place as one of the most popular and long-lasting attractions of that era. In the 1960s, Elizabeth Montgomery stood out as a renowned American actress, gaining fame and recognition worldwide. In addition to her film career, she was also a fervent advocate for civil rights and social causes. Elizabeth Montgomery actively engaged in the fight for women's rights and lent her support to the civil rights movement for African Americans. During the 1940s, Lana Turner stood out as one of the most stunning and talented actresses in Hollywood. In addition to her mastery in acting, her personal life was marked by controversies and dramas, adding further fascination to her already famous persona. Her involvement in scandals and tumultuous relationships only heightened her notoriety and the intrigue surrounding her. In the 1950s, at the age of 20, Joan Collins was a young, talented, an ambitious British actress. Born on May 23, 1933, in Paddington, London, Joan had already embarked on a promising trajectory in the entertainment industry. By 1953, she had already secured prominent roles in films such as Decameron Nights and The Woman's Angle. In the early years of the 1960s, Claudia Cardinale was a stunning Italian actress, renowned for her captivating beauty and exceptional talent. Her career in that decade established her as one of the most prominent actresses of the time, garnering fans both in Italy and on the international scene. In the British music scene of the 1970s, a young and visionary talent emerged by the name of Kate Bush, who stood out with a unique approach and artistic style that made her one of the most iconic artists of the era. In addition to her captivating music, Kate Bush also mesmerized audiences with her theatrical performances and innovative music videos. In the year 1980, two icons of the entertainment industry, Carrie Fisher and John Belushi, had a memorable encounter that would leave a lasting mark on their lives and the cultural landscape of the time. Carrie Fisher, already acclaimed as Princess Leia, and John Belushi, a talented actor and comedian known for his iconic role on the TV show Saturday Night Live, shared an unforgettable moment. In the year 1994, the MTV Video Music Awards ceremony witnessed a memorable encounter between two talented and beloved Hollywood artists, Sandra Bullock and Adam Sandler. On stage, Sandra Bullock and Adam Sandler were invited to co-present an award, offering a perfect combination of charm and humor. It was an unforgettable moment for fans and the entertainment industry. At the peak of his career in 1976, John Travolta emerged as a talented actor and dancer. At just 22 years old, he had already captured the hearts of the audience and established himself as one of Hollywood's most promising stars. In the year 1953, Ava Gardner, one of the most stunning stars of Hollywood's golden age, shone brightly. In addition to her undeniable talent as an actress, Ava Gardner was famous for her tumultuous personal life and captivating beauty. 
She was married to some of Hollywood's most desirable men, including Mickey Rooney, Artie Shaw, and Frank Sinatra. In the year 1941, Dorothy L'Amour was at the peak of her career, solidifying her status as one of the great stars of Hollywood. With her exotic beauty and versatile talent, she had captured the hearts of the audience and established herself as a cinema icon. In that same year, Dorothy L'Amour shone as the leading lady in the film The Thief of Baghdad, an epic fantasy that became a milestone in her professional journey. In the 1970s, Joan Collins, one of the most iconic actresses of her generation, radiated a vibrant glow. During this period, she showcased a sophisticated and glamorous look that became her trademark. In addition to her impeccable style, Joan Collins delighted the audience with a series of memorable roles in both film and television throughout the decade. During the vibrant 1970s, Lindsay Wagner, a talented American actress, made her mark with her magnetic presence and exceptional dramatic abilities. Born on June 22, 1949, in Los Angeles, California, she emerged as a rising star in this iconic period of entertainment history. Faye Ray, an iconic actress of the cinema, achieved worldwide fame through her unforgettable performance in the classic horror film King Kong, released in 1933. Ray's portrayal in King Kong was extraordinary, especially considering that a large portion of the scenes was filmed in the studio with primitive special effects. In the 1970s, Tina Louise, a talented American actress, made her mark with her elegant and captivating presence in the entertainment industry. Born on February 11, 1934, in New York, Louise gained recognition and popularity during this time, standing out in various notable projects. Faye Dunaway, a talented and versatile actress, left an indelible mark on cinema with her brilliant performance in Bonnie and Clyde, released in 1967. Dunaway showcased extraordinary talent while starring opposite Warren Beatty, who portrayed Clyde Barrow, Bonnie's partner. The chemistry between them on screen brought to life the intensity of the tumultuous relationship between the characters. In the 1980s, Angelina Jolie, a talented and iconic actress, emerged in the entertainment scene and quickly established herself as an influential and acclaimed figure. Born on June 4, 1975, in the United States, Jolie began her career as a model and theater actress before making her impactful debut in the world of cinema. In the early years of the 1990s, three young actresses shown in the popular television series Saved by the Bell, Elizabeth Berkley, Lark Voorhees, and Tiffany Thiessen. These talented artists were in the spotlight, bringing life and charisma to their iconic characters. In the early years of the 1990s, specifically around 1991, Brendan Fraser, a young and talented actor, was beginning to make his mark in the film industry. During this time, Fraser was taking his first steps in the world of entertainment, striving to carve out his place in the sun. In the 1970s, Pam Greer stood out as one of the most iconic and influential actresses of her generation. With her stunning beauty, exceptional talent, and magnetic presence, she became a true cinema icon of the era. Pam Greer was a pioneer in portraying strong and independent women on the big screen. Her contribution to female representation in cinema was remarkable and continues to be revered to this day. In the 1940s, Jinx Falkenberg stood out as one of the most captivating and admired personalities of the time. In addition to her career as a model, Falkenberg also made forays into the world of cinema, where she shone in films such as Cover Girl, alongside Jean Kelly and Rita Hayworth. Thank you for watching our video and we invite you to explore other related content on the incredible journey through the past that we have available on the screen. Keep enjoying this trip through time.